A documentary hoping to change the way schools approach learning is catching the attention of educators and lawmakers here in Central Texas. A screening is happening tonight at Dripping Springs High School. KXA and education reporter Aaron Cargo is there live with more. Aaron. Shannon and Robert, the documentary is called Most Likely to Succeed. Parents are filing out of the auditorium here after watching the film. Some are still inside discussing it. This is the third time that Dripping Springs ISD has hosted a screening for parents. And before this, they hosted screenings for every single school board member and employee. It premiered at the 2015 Sundance Film Festival and has been picking up steam ever since. A documentary examining the history of education, shortcomings of schools today, and highlights project-based learning that cultivates creativity and innovation. The film caught the attention of the Dripping Springs superintendent. This is much more hands-on, much messier, I think, like real life is, uh, much more collaborative and with a lot more Energy. He's been inviting parents to watch it because it's in line with the new five-year strategic plan the district is rolling out in the fall. I am currently sort of flip-flopping back and forth about homeschooling or leaving them in public school, and so I'm really just here to find out what the school is going to offer them for the next five years. The film's executive producer, who was in Austin last week for a screening, says his whole goal was to inspire schools to change. Now that message is reaching a higher level. When I was in Austin, I met on Wednesday with uh, two of the staff members for one of the uh, state legislative committees on education, and I met with the governor's advisor on education. And, you know, the, the thing that's interesting, right, is that, that Usually everybody hates everybody when it comes to issues that, that are policy issues. And what I find with this is the level of agreement is actually strikingly high. But not everyone in Dripping Springs is completely sold. There's been that reaction from parents and some kids, to be honest, that, you know, we're good at what we do already. Dr. Gearing says that success has come with change over time, and this is just another step in preparing students for the future. If they can pull this off, and this is where everything is going, then I think it can only be beneficial to the kids. And in all, about 400 parents have shown up to these screenings here in Dripping Springs. Now, the movie is not available on DVD or available through a live streaming service. The only way to see it right now is through these special screenings. I checked the schedule on the movie website, and it is actually being shown twice later this month at Crockett High School in South Austin. Live in Dripping Springs, Erin Cargile, KXAN News.